I have a question. Yeah. How? I watched it fall. It's sealed. It's called mathematics, love. How? Literally physics, love. The bottle is sealed. I watched you drop it. And yeah, now but, it's destroyed. But dropping it doesn't turn a bottle into that. Well, I watched it happen before my very eyes. Oh, yeah, okay. I'm not tripping, though. Like, it is sealed. Like... Yes. Do you think someone poisoned the water? <laughs> How did you get to that conclusion? Because I've never seen a water bottle do that. But hey, hip hop, it's a weird industry. It's now the most popular music genre in the world. And I would say it's definitely the fastest moving genre of music in the world right now. I have a philosophical question. Already before I've said one sentence in the entire video? Yeah. If pop is short for like popular music mm -hmm. and rap is the most popular type of music right now, does that mean that rap is technically pop? I don't think I have the qualifications to answer that question. But hip hop is the most popular industry right now and it's definitely the fastest moving industry because every time you like turn around, there's some new or old artist who just blows up out of nowhere. Some are extremely young, like Lil Tekka and Lil Mosey who blew up at age 15 and others, others, love. others, I don't know how I said all those and others are just um, not quite as young. I guess that's the best way of putting it. And well, today's video, I guess, is just on the American version of Pete and Bass. And if you don't know who Pete and Bass is, here's a little snippet of them. See, they just voted Brexit and dropped a club banger. So they're from the UK, and I guess they now have competition from the US. So I guess it's time to meet Frank and Maury. I, I guess this is Frank. Say hello to your mother for me. That was very nice, Frank. Thank you. Thank you. I will greet her from you. You know, what's something that I think all of the generations alive right now can put their arms together and agree upon? What? Just any form of your mom jokes. <laughs> I like how this boomer just straight up said, like, say hello to your mother for me. <laughs> any generation would just try pull that joke. You have like the two arms holding each other like that. And then you have the variant of the meme where like there's like eight arms holding each other. That's just all the generations now. I think there's no, there's like one image where there's four arms. Just yeah. All the generations. That's what like, I was thinking. Okay, of. mom jokes. And uh, this is Maury. Reaper couldn't get me. What makes you think you have a chance? Ah, <laughs> I don't know. The fact that I don't have to take an afternoon nap. You don't? Okay, I actually do. I need more sleep. Let's check out this song of theirs. Frank and Murray, Money Talks, produced by Stevie Baby. You gonna play the whole one and just accept defeat? Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just kind of accepting defeat that this video is going to get claimed. This video is 100% probably gonna get claimed. So, I mean, hey guys, if you guys wanna join the channel membership, feel free to support the channel by joining the membership. Don't really have any perks for you guys, but you guys would at least be supporting the channel, hey? Eh? That was the worst sales pitch to join a channel membership in the history of channel membership pitches. I'm just trying to figure out why it's 10 p.m. after a long day. We're filled with this for absolutely no money. Buy my merch. Link in the description. <laughs> Don't keep my bid in, though, because that was a little too sassy. Sorry. <laughs> I feel like we should take it. But doesn't make it seem like we only do it for... No, of course we don't do it for money or else we wouldn't be doing it now. Frank and Murray, Money Talks, produced by Stevie Baby Babe. Okay, in September 2019, two men were found recording rap music in a Dunkin' Donuts bathroom. Frank, 75 years old, and Maury, 92 years old. They were removed, removed from the premises immediately. Not before <laughs> recording a six-track EP. <laughs> okay. This is track number one. Damn it, I love you, Steve. Flip the bird, the red light. Phone sex with my ex wife. Four bottles, one night. I'm on the subway home having fist fights. <laughs> Boomers after ruining the world's economy. Biggest prank ever. <laughs> I feel pranked, honestly. What is this? <laughs> French fries, a little sriracha. Four in the morning, watching every potter. Counting money in my white boxers. You need a little hit, you know that I got ya. I got a 40 in the bag with your name on it. Imagine storming Normandy Beach and dropping a song that TikTok kids dance to in the same lifetime. Walking out the deli with a. Checking in my belly. 
They're like 70 years older than most rappers, but still have better bars. Like this song somehow has the energy of Bad Grandpa and The Bucket List. When you switch medication with the others at the old folks' home. I feel like nursery home crime went up 300% after they dropped this music video. You know, like Gen X and I guess Gen Y are millennials. They, they go like, ha, ah, hold my beer. You know, their version of that would be like, oh, hold my teeth. Let me drop a hot verse. Money talks and I talk bad, talk bad, talk bad. I honestly love the beat. I like actually want to put this song on my playlist now. Like seriously, it's solid. It's actually really good. It was not what I was expecting at all. <laughs> They're like the boomers we don't actually have, but the ones we actually deserve. It's very true. Why aren't they the world leaders right now? Frank and Maury instead of old people in the Senate. Truer words have never been spoken. Thank you. Did you like the dab? Yeah. Oh my goodness, Frank and Murray money talks. Let's check out some of the top comments here. Everybody, old people can't rap. Frank and Murray, hold my teeth. <laughs> Yo, it's like another variant of my joke. <laughs> when boomers get tired of people saying boomer, are we just gonna ignore that this has over a million views? Why does this sound a lot better than a lot of the songs nowadays? We're kind of in like a fast food rap age if that makes sense because a lot of the very popular hip-hop music is very popular because of its beat and then the lyrics and whatever's on the song vocally really doesn't matter so the shelf life of that song is basically the shelf life of the beat if that makes sense hence why i guess it's better than a lot of music that's pumping out in the hip-hop scene objectively obviously because hey music is just an objective thing some people love some sorts other people like other sorts i think it's subjective that's what i was that's the word i was looking for thank you you truly complete me they look like mermaid man and barnacle boy from sponge oh boy that one's true <laughs> that is kind of true <laughs> i'm gonna tell my kids this is eminem and cheesy <laughs> when your grandpa wins in bingo six nine when he gets out of prison <laughs> Oh, no! No! <laughs> oh, that would be 6 9 if he got out of prison if he didn't snitch at all. Now I think he's coming out a little earlier. I'm gonna tell my kids they were the Migos after Takeoff left. Wait, did Takeoff leave the Migos? Cardi is apparently engaged to Iggy Azalea. Who knew that? <laughs> I'm actually surprised you caught on to that. I was just like yelling an, an audible thing, trying to be Iggy Azalea on stage live. <laughs> no, the top comment is who's here before they're dead. That's so bad. All jokes aside, this is low key fire. I, I have to agree with that, honestly. Who do you think forced them into doing this, though? The OK Boomer joke. They got fed up from all the OK Boomers and they were like, you know what? Let's drop a fire club banger. That's the meme, but you know, well, there's like some millennials behind this. Oh, I would definitely point at Stevie Baby. But whoever produced it definitely is in on something here. I bet you this guy produced everything for them. The next five tracks on their EP was probably going to be produced by the same guy. Nunchucks in my backpack. Step too close, I'm swinging at your nutsack. Prick you with the thumbtack. Stick you with the blicky in the lunch bag. I'm surprised they didn't get like hyperthermia from being in the pool for too long. It's straight fire. I'm excited for their second, third, fourth, fifth, and sixth song. I, I need this entire EP out like right now. Do you think they'll go on tour? If they go on tour, I, I'm getting front row seats. Like I'm going to be standing there in the front. If they have a show and there's a mosh pit, I started it. 
You heard it here first. I guess what we can take away from today's video is uh, boomers got bars, for sure. If I had a, a genius verified mark, I would verify them. I don't know what that means, but like they're verified in my eyes. I co-sign them. That's the word I was looking for. They get my co-sign for sure. But yeah, this video will be going up around the time of Thanksgiving. So if it's before, if it's after Thanksgiving, or if it's on the day, have a wonderful day. Spend it with friends and friendly. <laughs> Period. That's it, that's the video. Just, just spend it with friends and friendly, guys. I'm tired, I'm so tired. But anyway, this video will be coming out sometime around Thanksgiving, so if it's on the day, happy Thanksgiving. If it's before Thanksgiving, I hope you guys have a wonderful Thanksgiving. And if it's after Thanksgiving, I hope you guys had a wonderful Thanksgiving. I hope you guys spent it with friends and family and loved ones. And this year's Thanksgiving, just like last year's Thanksgiving, I am extra thankful for what I have here on YouTube and just here in this office, just everything. My, my current career can't be more thankful. This is the best job in the world. So uh, thank you guys. I, I know I haven't had too many videos and too many moments where I've actually thanked you guys for the current position that I currently am in. It really means a lot to me and I'm very thankful for where I am right now. If you guys enjoyed the video, please drop a like on it. If you're new here, I welcome you to the channel. It'll be awesome if you subscribed and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace. Me, I'ma let it run into the bag like I'm so athletic. I've been up since six, making hits like tennis. I've been on fire, I just need my credit. Wanna go far, need to change my settings. Reaching for the stars on so my feet, touch heaven. I've been head first, bitch, already want seconds.